popular summer camp and field trip spot, thousands of kids tour Gale Woods Farm every year. The Three Rivers Park District owns it, but the crops and the animals are not just for show. This morning, Derusha eats at a West Suburban restaurant, bringing the farm to your table. It is a typical summer day on this West Suburban Minnesota farm. Farmers in the fields pulling weeds. A crew washing carrots, another washing freshly harvested greens. The pigs doing their thing and fertilizing the soil. We're at Gale Woods Farm in Minnetrista. But Gale Woods Farm is not an ordinary farm. 410 acres donated to Three Rivers Park District in 2000. This isn't just for show. This right. isn't just for the classroom. Right. We're a real operating farm. Um, and that was how the Gales wanted it, so that people could really understand where their food's coming from. Andy Anderson runs programming at Gale Woods, helping teach the 25,000 kids who visit. Pigs are pretty efficient, aren't they? Very efficient. And they will literally eat anything. And helping train the dozens of young people who get their first jobs here. We're teaching them leadership skills. We're trying to get them interview skills, um, things that are going to help them be successful later on in their life, along with bridging that gap and making that connection to where their food comes from. But all of the vegetables and fruits and meat raised on the farm goes up for sale. The West Tonka and Brooklyn Center schools buy some of the crops. Yeah, they get into the into the garden and get dirty and dig and help with that. And then their school lunchroom will serve that. They even had their culinary arts students learn knife skills on our carrots that were then served in their lunchroom. So, yeah, really great connection. And Stephanie and Matt Bowles at Dakota Junction Restaurant in Mound are also customers. The taste is just so much more colorful. It's just so, it makes such a difference. The lettuce these young women are washing travels less than two miles from the farm to the Dakota Junction table. Everything tastes so bright. The greens and the, the tomatoes are bursting. They use it in a killer BLT sandwich. The grass-fed beef from the farm is in a knockout of a made-right sandwich. This is grass-fed beef from the farm. Oh, yeah. Mm. It's very good. When cyclists stop here, we, it's fun to say, oh, you just passed Gale Woods Farm in Big Stone. Yeah. You just passed where your food came from. It's a unique merger of culinary awesomeness and educational enrichment, a chance to give suburban kids a taste of the farm life. When things are produced in season, they taste better. Oh, it's true, they do. Anybody can go to Gale Woods Farm, and you can go explore it on your own. It's open in Minnetrista seven days a week, nine to five most days, noon to five on Sunday. If you're free on Saturday, July 23rd, they're having a fundraiser. They call it a summer bration at the farm. Dakota Junction, the restaurant mm -hmm. we featured there, will be cooking. So all of that money goes to the foundation at Three Rivers Very Park good. District, and that helps keep those programs going. I love that they're able to say, hey, two miles ago, you just passed where your food is coming from. I love that. It's really cool cool and I've been out there before and just never quite thought like what do they do with all this stuff they're growing so it's really cool that they end up in the schools and in that one really nice restaurant in Mound. The food is great too yeah. so worth a visit just Absolutely. in that restaurant. Great story.